Okay, next to transfer the pattern, I use this steel-tipped poker to poke along the design lines. Um, this is very sharp and so you have to be careful that uh, children are supervised if they're going to be doing this process. I poke closer together when it's a smaller detail and I can poke further apart, probably quarter inch, on parts of the pattern that aren't so detailed. So for instance, on the star here, I want to make a bunch of poke marks so that, and close together, so that when I go to carve it out, I'll be able to see the star and get that little detail done. Now you don't have to poke all the way through as you saw. I was poking part way through and it makes a good mark on the pumpkin. Okay, now when you're carving somewhat parallel lines, what I do, and if you can zoom in here, I make poke marks opposite each other on this part that's going to be cut out. The reason I do that is that it will then show me exactly how uh, to carve here. If, for instance, I did one here just to exaggerate, it doesn't show me, you know, how far apart I'm supposed to be. So I found it very helpful to poke just opposite on lines when they're either parallel or something like this where they're very close together. Okay, now I'm going to show you what this looks like. I'll finish the poking a little later. But this will give you an idea how it looks. There is that star that I told you about. Here's that poking parallel. And then you can see that my marks are a lot closer here than, for instance, on this detail or this big long mark. Now, if you have a pumpkin that has kind of multicolor and it's very difficult to see these dots, what you can do is take just some regular flour and rub it along, and then your dots show up very clearly. Okay, let's say that I've taken the pattern off and I discover, oops, I forgot to poke one of these details. Here's what I do is I take one of my, the holes that I've poked and then line it up with the hole on the pumpkin, hold that, then I find another one and line it up with the hole on the pumpkin here. Let's see, it's right here. Tape it down and then I can poke along, let's say I forgot this feature here. So you can line up the holes that you've poked, retape it, and then complete the part that you might have missed.